Hello everyone, this is Fawaz from Australia and Rep.com. This article is about immigration to Australia on Australia and Rep.com. Immigration to Australia is always a topic that gets both positive and negative opinions. Always a conversational topic. So before we come to conclusion, here are a few notable or rather informative things about immigration to Australia. The top immigrants to Australia are from UK, New Zealand, China, Italy and Vietnam, which contributes to about 22% of the total Australian population. Australia's net overseas migration rose from around 1,43,000 migrants in 2014 to 2005 to around 2,39,000 migrants in 2011 to 2012. There are several types of visas available to immigrants. The most important ones among these are skilled and temporary work subclass 457. The most help helpful of these schemes is subclass 457 with countries competing to be the best in the world in business economy and science a country needs a wide range of manpower with varieties of skills australia comparatively have a small population and there are a lot of businesses that cannot that cannot find an australian citizen to compete but overall the immigration always had a positive impact on the australia and made it a more, more powerful nation socially and economically by 2050 migration will be a contribution of whooping $1,625 billion to Australian GDP. Migration will ensure that Australia always remains a highly skilled nation with a stable economy. Be sure to hit the like and subscribe button of our page and make sure to comment below. See you down there.